Well, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. Here we have our six intrepid, uh, what, dupes? <laughs> six intrepid dupes. Uh, they're just sort of snoozing in their beds. Okay, so I, I did do a little bit of uh, more, a little more prep work. The time has passed. It's cycle 94. Um, essentially, yeah, they, the tasks get so large that, uh, I, mean, I mean, you could just sort of watch them all run around sweeping things up and all of that, but that's not very exciting. So really, it you know, there's a bit of time in between each one. So uh, I like to build up some tasks and all of that, but we have a problem. No, 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 no. We're running out of water. Uh, this is an issue. So the water is what's driving my oxygen right now. Without water, I can't breathe. So uh, what is oxygen like right now? Uh, see, it's, it's okay, but it's mixed. Um, essentially, it, it, it goes up and down, up and down. Um, now, <coughs> let's take a look at a few things first. Uh, this is kind of interesting. The uh, mealwood in the natural farm is under ideal air pressure, harvest remaining two, ideal temperature, excellent yield, harvest ready, harvest pending. So this this does work. It's actually kind of cool. It's a bit slow, uh, but it actually gives you all the ideal stuff by just simply planting them on, you know, standard ground. So uh, is it, is it, I'm going to, uh, this is just mostly a test. I wanted to see how this works. Someone suggested it and I thought I'd give it a shot. Uh, I do want to do a proper, um, you know, how th how the the agricultural upgrade, how it's intended to be done. I, I want to do that as well. And so uh, I'll be working on that. One of the questions I have is how to achieve ideal pressure. But uh, if there's a mechanical means of doing that, and I'll, I'll have to look into it. Um, uh, let's take a look at one other thing. Uh, I did manage to finish all research, I think. Yes, I did. So all the research is done. Uh, now, water. Sorry, we got distracted by the uh, natural farm here. Uh, water. What am I going to do about water? Well, I built a cistern. Uh, anybody who saw my last series will recognize my basic design. Uh, fresh water on the left, cistern on the right, um, different, you know, like an air scrubber pulling out uh, CO2 and, and uh, dumping the, the water or the, the polluted water into the cistern. Uh, generally, this, this, is, this is sort of, and I'm going to put in a water filtration system that will then put this water into the, the clean this water and put it into here. So I need uh, either polluted water to convert into clean water, or I need clean water, or I need both. So if we look at our map, we'll see I did push out here, and there is indeed a steam geyser, and there is indeed water here. Uh, this is a uh, this is going to be the start of my uh, cascade system to bring water down into here. This is polluted water. Uh, I've put in a pump. A liquid pump and I've started running uh, the lick the polluted water this is being built right now it's not complete but they've done a bunch of work on it and this is running to, to, to dump into my uh, polluted cistern my polluted water cistern so that's one source uh, this looks like it could be mostly clean water once it's actually done but uh, this is the slime biome and polluted water it gets in here I want to be able to uh, probably before I tackle this I might go after this but I'm not sure this might be better it's it's warm but not as hot as the last time I did this so uh, for now I'm gonna pull whatever's out of here but how I refill this up whether it be from the polluted water or from this uh, geyser water I'm not really sure yet. I might just do the polluted water first. Uh, this, of course, polluted water right here. I, as soon as I break the breach up into here, this is going to go down here. Yeah. 
So, uh, and then of course, if this water level fall drops, I could always put another gate system here, that kind of thing. So I do have a plan, but it's a bit of a race against time uh, as to you know when I'm going to be able to finish constructing all of this, get this all built and, and filtering water and dumping it in here, and when this water runs out. And this water seems to be running out fairly quickly. So, uh, which brings me to... Uh, I, <coughs> I have been on my heels in this game since the beginning. So, lurching from one emergency to another. The current emergency is I'm running out of uh, fresh water. My hope is to, once I get the whole water, oxygen thing sorted out, I can focus on the proper agricultural upgrade, uh, like producing real food, uh, designing uh, uh, gardens that will produce uh, maximum yield through, through controlled atmosphere, water, and, 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 and fertilizer means, and all that other stuff. Okay, but until I get things like the basics, like oxygen and water and all of that sorted out, and power, uh, I can't really focus on that because, you know, <laughs> it's just keep, this stuff keeps happening. So, all right. And the last thing I wanted to bring up before we start is, uh, yeah, this whole thing with it all being one horizontal. Th it, th this is a terrible design. If I was to redesign this for a small space like this and rectangular, I would have made it into a column where uh, these guys were at the bottom and then there's permeable tile and then maybe a bit of, of space and then uh, 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 the, 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 the hydrogen generator, and then some space, and then the, uh, the uh, maybe one or two oxygen pumps at the top. For now, to because I've got this already built and designed this way, I'm going with the cone design. So once this, this is all dug out and there's a cone, uh, what I'll do is I will uh, move this gas pump up here, or maybe even carve out this here, and put the gas pump right at the tip like this uh, maybe a second one uh, but for now this is this is this is basically my workaround it's not perfect uh, but it it my hope is it'll do the job and the other thing I want to do is uh, is I'm gonna probably remove this airlock and I'm gonna take one of these electrolyzers Ma I'm gonna take this one I'm gonna put it over here and that'll spread out the distance between the electrolyzers uh, across here so that they, you know, one goes up there, one goes up here, one goes up that way. And hopefully that'll minimize the amount of time that they spend at max pressure and maximize their throughput, which would maximize their hydrogen generation, which would maximize the generator running and also maximize oxygen production all at the same time. Maximize, maximize, maximize. <laughs> Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm being silly now. So <laughs> that's that's the plan. Uh, this is not. I, I recognize that this is not awesome, but I'm just sort of working with the existing design that I already have. Um, hmm. Do I want to keep this here, or do I want to just do all the work from over here? Yeah. You know what? <coughs> I think. I think I'm going to cancel that and I'll leave the ladder in there for now, but I can, I'll can i deconstruct it later at my leisure. But for now, they can just go through here, up and over, and then they can start doing all the work this way. This is quicker, but uh, I, I, no, 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 let's just do that. More volume is a little bit better, as long as there's a cone here that it'll be fine. So, okay. Uh, let's go. They're sleeping right now. Uh, food is, uh, it was pretty high and then I let it drop. We're gonna, we're gonna see what happens once they harvest all these mealwood. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'll uh, turn this into, yeah, right now it's making lice loaf. And then I can't really do anything with lice in the cook station. Uh, this takes mush bars, bristleberry. Uh, this takes meal lice, but it's grizzly. I mean, is it any better than the other one? Well, you know, uh, this takes meat. 
this takes sleet wheat. Yeah. See, I, I can't do anything with what I've got right now, so I'm just going to let them eat meal lice. Uh, it's not exactly, and or uh, lice loaf. Uh, the lice loaf is, what is lice loaf? Lice loaf is quality too. If I made the pickled stuff, uh, it would be even, it would be worse. Yes, it's down here, right? So, okay. That's it, fish. You clean that. Clean that toilet. <laughs> All right. So circuit overloaded. I that's the other thing. I gotta redesign. I gotta get that circuit thing sorted out. So there's just so much to do. Um, also, because of this being a slime biome, pollution is a big issue. So I've been I put in some uh, of these air deodorizers. I staged them. So that by the time over here, the air is pretty clean. And then I blocked all this off here so that we don't get the uh, polluted air down into the base. Uh, is it? Oh, there's air over there. Okay. Not over here. It's, it's not great, but it's not terrible. Um, that reminds me, I do have... I do have valves now. So maybe... Hmm. What's my food at? Yeah, we went up to 16. Okay. So, all right. Uh, let's see what we're going to do. Uh, this is where I... Okay, yeah. Stress is, is, of course, an issue. Everybody's hovering between basically... Well, Night Wrath's doing okay, but dread from Dread through Bish between the 20s and, and 30s. So, uh, generally, stress is an issue mostly because I'm in a panic, working them ragged. Uh, I haven't had a chance to focus on decor. Let's take a l I don't need any new duplicates, but let's take a quick look. Vomiter, Cryer, Destructive. Yeah, creativity, learning. I don't need research. I don't need an artist. Um, I don't need a small bladder. So yeah, we're, we would reject them anyways, so. All right. Uh, I am getting a bit of water out of this uh, CO2 scrubber, so that's kind of nice. Uh, CO2 is under control in the base, mostly, except for in here. But they don't go in. They only go here f for a moment. What I should probably do is, yeah, I, I'll do something about that in the long run. But right now, water is the, the primary issue. Okay, bedtime. Good. They're building this. I think what I'm going to do is prioritize uh, building that, 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 and that, yeah. <coughs> we got to get this water. We got to get this water in here. Now, the other thing I need to do is design a uh, filtration system. Now, this could be bad because... Does the water filter? Well, we'll find out. Let's let's refine that. Uh, water purifier. Can I put the water? I can put the water purifier here. You know what really sucks is the outputs on the right, and I don't think I can change it. Yeah, I can't. I can't rotate this bad boy. That that that's a that's painful. Yeah, see how it's drawing so much water out of there. Wow. Okay, so uh, let me think here for a sec. Uh, I could put lavatories in, and that would give us polluted water as well. But it would also increase our water consumption. Right now, the electrolyzers are the biggest problem. So um, do I want to put this here? Yes. Okay. And so now we've got to run some plumbing. Okay, I need a water pump. Man, I always have trouble finding everything in here. It's not a very big list. So, wait a minute. Why am I having trouble finding the water pump? See, as I said, you guys are staring at it. By the way, when I review the footage, I do the same thing. God, it's right there. Why can't you see it? <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> uh, liquid pipe. So we want to go... Um, are they going to be able to reach that? Yeah. Now, I think I'm going to go up the middle, like 
Like that. Okay. Input and then output. We want to go. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Uh, if I put pipe here, they're not going to be able to reach it. Well, they might be able to reach it. Let's see what happens. Okay, I'm going to run that pipe up here. Uh, I need a I need a liquid bridge. Okay, and then uh, intake uh, like that, like that, and then I need liquid pipe. I'm going to go over there. And I'm going to go right there. And then a liquid vent. Oh, they built it. OK. We're still holding out on water. We're still holding out. Oxygen's good. Um, every once in a while, actually, what I do is uh, I'll turn this off there, uh, and that'll what that oh wow. See, that's actually been not bad lately. It does stop, but okay. I turn off the oxygen production, and then that. If we take a look now at at water, we'll see that it it's it slows the draw a bit. We're still doing it for the ox the CO two scrubber. Um, oh, let's take a look at our duplicate choice. Vomit, cry, vomit. Wow. Lindsay, you're not bad. You're a local yokel with diver's lungs and grizzly food quality. I'm still going to reject you, though. Um, also, I think the, there's a few reasons why um, stress is an issue. Um, the food, I think, is the primary issue. I, because their, their expectations are going up, uh, I'm not able to meet their expectations, and they're they're suffering. So it sucks, but I, there's not much I can do about it. Oh, they did. They could. Ma they managed to build it. Excellent. Now the other thing I need to do is run power. Um. Oh, I think I'm going to run heavy watt wire. I need to start doing this. Um. How's my copper? Ten thousand. We're doing good. When I dug, when I dug all this out, it uh, gave me a whole bunch of copper. There's still a whole bunch of copper right here. So, copper's not super critical. Uh, I want to run this across here like this. If this is a hidden area, um, and then what we'll do? I mean, it's not really hidden, but. It's uh, it, they shouldn't be traveling through there very much. Now I need a. Now I've heard a wire bridge can act as a transformer. Uh, but uh, you know I'm going to try to do this the way that they intend it. Uh, oh wow, these things are massive. Oh good God. Oh this is not good. Oh. Okay. Uh, we're going to have to do the wire bridge thing for now. <laughs> Oops. Uh, and then what I'll do is, let's see, I want to run power down here. So we're going to go like that. And then I want to run, we're going to do this like that. And then we're going to deconstruct wires. Uh, and then we're going to run electric wire, electric wire here like that. And then we're going to run electric wire down to this bad boy. Like that. And then uh, I need to be able to hook... Yeah, this is, see, I, I have to, oh, the other thing I have to do, these guys, these guys are causing nothing but trouble. They are, uh, no, deconstruct all. 
There we go. Uh, they're causing these guys to run on the, because the, the, they're the bat this level of the tiny battery gets super low super fast, so they end up running on the wheel again. So uh, I have to de deconstruct them. This is the start of this system. Uh, I need to do better. I need to run this heavy watt wire all the way out to the battery compartment. Uh, and of course, that's going to be a problem because you can't run this through uh, walls. So uh, for now, though, I'm just I'm just fiddling. I want to. This is the backbone. I'm going to try this out. Uh, let's see if I. Hmm. Really, what I want to do is uh, run the heavy watt wire to the batteries, and then uh, the generator down to the heavy watt wire. The space is not designed properly for this. Uh, really, what I should do is get rid of all of this here, the storage, and have make this whole section down here, uh, like uh, transformers and all that other stuff. And yeah, I didn't design this properly, but oh well. Uh, what I should, what I'm going to need to do eventually is probably break out some tiles. Yeah. Okay. So heavy watt wire. Let's just do it. Um, this goes up here, and we're just going to have to go across. They're going to have to live with the fact there's heavy watt wire in the cistern. And yeah, we're gonna we're gonna deconstruct this, and then we're gonna run heavy watt wire in here, like that. Yeah. Now, oh wait a minute. Uh, I have to deconstruct that and that okay for now though um, for now I can use a uh, we're just gonna patch the system in uh, like this yeah uh, it's it's awful it's I'm gonna I look before you write your comment saying that's the worst electrical design I've ever seen um, please understand that I recognize this completely and I'm just panicking trying to get this in and this is the, the shortest path. We're going to obviously, I think we're going to have to rework that quite a bit. Uh, I've probably screwed something up in there, uh, but, you know, <laughs> I don't really know what else to do. Oh, dear. Okay. Uh, I also need them to prioritize building... Uh, this and all of that. Yeah. All right. But um, it's nice to have this. Now, this is a problem. Uh, I probably am going to have to airlock that because of the polluted oxygen. So we're going to do this and we're going to put an airlock right here. Yeah, see, this is... I can't see it right now, but uh, this is nasty, this air in here, so... Oh, that's that's also a kind of a quick and dirty route for them to get up there. Oh, sweet. The building, that's it, guys. Okay. Uh, let's prioritize a few other things. Um, it looks like we've got a bridge into the electrical. Good. We're going to... No, not at five. Oh, my God. I've caught a bunch of things in there that I didn't want to catch in there. What did I do? Good. Okay, that's right. Excellent. Okay. Now, are you building that too? Um, no power. Because I haven't got... I've got this switched off. Okay. Well, that's actually fine. That's fine. That's fine. That switch apparently also turns off our water pumping system. 
<laughs> oh, this electrical design is awful. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm actually, uh, I, I actually can design circuits <laughs> in real life. <laughs> I'm going to dig this out because that's just weird. There we go. Dig it out. That's it. Right out from under him. Good. Good job. Good job. Okay. Uh, excellent. Now, I'm going to prioritize uh, this part of it uh, to four. We'll, we'll get to that eventually. Uh, but for now, is this? it's got power. There's no warning. Okay. We're going to flip this bad boy on. Uh, see, I see, see how long it takes? I turn that thing off and it's the and air starts to drop pretty quick. Uh, but I do need that on because I need to... Uh, I need to see... I need to test this whole system and see if it works. Hmm... Oh, right. Um, what is it? Power, uh, heavy watt wire. We want to run that there. Eventually, we'll, we'll hook all that together. But for now, I don't want to, you know. Is that not? No, six. And then, okay, power, heavy watt wire. <coughs> Everybody's got to go potty. Everybody's got to go potty. Hey, it's working. Pump, pump, pump. Hey, sweet. All right, let's take a look at our power situation. I didn't run power down there. Okay, well, uh, power, electric wire, standard electric wire. We're going to just do at a, at a six. There we go. We're, get, we're getting water. Now, what I should do is, uh, well, no, we'll just leave it like this. So I don't know if I've ever discussed why I use a cistern instead of running pipes directly into the filtration system. Well, why do I do this, right? Why do I, why do I use a holding tank for, for water? Like, why do I use a cistern? Um, there's a reason for that. Actually, let's, before we get into that, what's, is this damaged? What was going on there? I'm going to have to keep an eye on this. It's not too hot. It's just 35 degrees. And that water went in there. Good, 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 good. Okay, this is filling up. Excellent. It's not got any power. Why does it not have any power? Did I break something? I think I broke something. Uh, I. Oh, my God. I did, too, didn't I? Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to use the bridge and we're going to, uh, can I run a bridge through the wall? It looks like I can. And then deconstruct wire like that. And then we'll take a look at our uh, power again. Okay. And then I want to prioritize this. <coughs> okay. How's it going, guys? Come on, you got to build that. You have to build it. I know you're trying. I know you're trying. You delivered ore. Good. But I'm getting water. Water purifier, not pumping. 
Hmm. Come on. Oh, did we almost be Hey, it's working. It's working. Good. I need to expand the battery banks. I'll probably this is what I started doing here. I'll probably just uh dig down here. Okay. And we're out of power. Oh, but it's sort of got power from this. So this is the next focus. We're going to build this up. Man, this is a really nasty little area down here. <laughs> it's pretty awful. Okay. All right. So we're secu we've secured water. Uh, I can breach this to, to fill this up. Uh, this will give us polluted water, which will fill up this guy, and then we can draw water in here. Now, what's going on here? Not pumping. It, 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 what? Why is it not pumping? Does it need sand? Uh, it's not... Is it short sand? Did I design this incorrectly? There's polluted water going into it. Oh, did I not finish? What's going on here? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this heavy wire is a pain in my <laughs> Okay, all right. So intake is white. And we want to do that. Okay. <laughs> and I, oh, wait a minute. I want to prioritize that. Oh, that heavy wire that I mean, it, I like the challenge of it because it does force you to make certain decisions and design your base around it. And I think that's really good. Um, hang on. Food. Food's okay. All right. There we go. We're filling up. We got water coming in. Overload damage. Yeah, obviously, we've got some serious problems. We have serious issues here with power. Uh, we're overloading. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is, well, first of all, uh, that's not even running, but we're going to... Yeah, that's not even... Is that even running? Disable building? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what else? Hmm. I mean, I can get rid of the research stations. They're not needed anymore. We've got complete research, right? But, okay, let's take a look. Oh, uh, you know what it is? It's just that we don't we're not producing enough power. It's overloading, but we're not producing enough power. That's all it is. Uh I'll it, it's also being damaged. This has to be completely redesigned. Uh What I this this main bus here needs to be replaced with this heavy watt wire, so essentially uh, like this connect this up here like this 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 connection from this generator down to the heavy watt wire has to be direct and disconnected from everything else. Yeah, I have to rework the power situation, but right now we're just simply we're just overloaded, and uh, this thing is probably yeah. Okay, so next thing we got to get this sucker sorted out. So I think we're going to prioritize um, basically all of this. No. You know, I, one of these days, I'm actually going to do this correctly. 
Okay. Now, is everybody alive? I'm not paying any attention here. Uh, let's take a look. Duplicant, destruct, vomit, binge eater. This is the only, yeah. Gas, okay, reject all. All right, I think I can disable the uh, disable the building, right? Yeah, I can disable it. We'll we'll re-enable it back when we um, actually need it again. So, oh, did that make them all go to bed, or was that coincidence? <laughs> did I just put the entire colony to sleep forever? <laughs> that would be funny if it was true, because now that they're asleep, nobody can turn it back on again. <laughs> Uh, food is becoming an issue again. I'll crank that up. But for now, this is... We've got to get this sorted out. Um, yeah. And I need I need to increase the battery banks. So, uh, I'm going to dig... Um, okay, one, two, three. Uh, yeah. And then let's, uh, actually, that, let's cancel. Let's, uh, do this. And we want to, we want to actually start getting into double wall, uh, down here because, uh, this water could potentially. And this, it, it could fill up to like up to about here, right? And uh, so we need to make sure that this is all sorted out. Okay, how's it going up here? Oh, they can't reach that. Okay, that makes sense. All right, so we want to build a ladder uh, up to there. Actually, you know what? The ladder would be better over here. So we're going to cancel this. Uh, cause that would, that would ruin the bit of the cone, right? So. That's a roundabout way to get to the bathroom, Alice. That's it. You build that. And then once you've built that, you can actually get into there. Good, good. Yeah. Uh, in general, I'm just going to say I, I do need to work on the whole, this we need we need to work on power and all of other stuff like this should have a dedicated line going down to the heavy watt wire uh with no branches off of it but it's actually tip powering this as well and all kinds of stuff like that so there's yeah this is this whole thing is horribly flawed i know it is i, I know it is uh gas pump i'm gonna put a gas pump right here And we're going to disable this one. And then we're going to run... Uh, we're going to run electric wire up to that one. And I should prioritize that. Are we snacking up here, really? They can't reach that. That's okay. So that's fine. We don't need it. Okay. All right. So is that disabled? Good. So between the two of them, like one will pick up mostly hydrogen. The other will pick up. Oh, I need to uh, run plumbing. I need to run the airline. Gas pipe. Uh... Uh, and I should have prioritized that as well. Good grief. There we go. Food shortage. Yeah, I'm aware that we have a food shortage. That's okay, though. We can um, we can crank up. Uh, we're going to get rid of those. It's because we ran out of lice. So, And we'll do the continuous mush bars and everything, everything will be fine. Of course, that's a yet another power draw, but whatever. Okay, let's get that other pump in there. Uh, 
Come on. Run, little guys, run. We're, we're overloading. We're down to 1,000 calories. Uh, I'm probably going to have to crank up the priority of the microbe musher. And let's convert this. Yeah, that's right. Emma, good job making food, keeping us alive. All right, so we've got full hydrogen. Let's see if this can maintain. Probably not, but we're going to find out. I still need to build another electrolyzer over here. And, oh, let's do, let's do that. Deconstruct that and that. Nope. And that. What did I just deconstruct? Cancel. I want to deconstruct building. There we go. All right. <coughs> See, we've got water coming in. We've got water going through. This may not be able to keep up, but, you know, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Did they deconstruct? Not yet? Okay. Good. And then we want to put in um, uh, oxygen, electrolyzer. We want to put one here. Uh, and then we want to run plumbing. There. And power. Like that, because, yeah, we need yet more power. And then what we're going to do is we're going to disable that one. And then that what that'll do is we'll have one here, one here, one here. And that should, di that should help with... Uh, see, that one, yeah, it's already disabled, so... And that'll, that'll uh, allow a little bit more flow through, I think. Oh, we've got meal lice coming in. And we're at 8,000 calories. Good. Prioritize six. Just prioritize. Okay. And it's bedtime. All right. I think we're in the home stretch here. Um, we're, we're getting water sorted. We got a bit of a water situation over here. This is uh, a repair pen. This is going to die because this is... Yeah, we're overloading our, our wiring and everything, and that's terrible, but whatever. Uh, I, this is getting empty, but that's fine. Uh, what we can do is uh, punch through. Hang on, let me cancel that. And let's punch through. Let's just punch through right up here like this. Now, how much is that? Is that going to fill... Is that going to overflow? I don't know. Do I want to go after... What is this? Oxygen. Included oxygen. Do I want to go after this one first? I think I might. Okay. Let's cancel. It's a smaller amount of water. And then we can go after that one. Like that. And then we're going to... We're going to dig... Like that. And we're at back at a food shortage again. Okay. How's this doing over here? Okay, we've got these guys all running, but they need power. That's because nobody's on the wheel. Come on. And that's been repaired. Good. Food shortage. Yeah. Yeah, right now there's just so much demand on the system. But this is the basic idea. I just got to figure... I got to get all this other stuff sorted. Once they're both running. Yeah. Come on. Overload damage. Yeah. They're spending a lot of time fixing overloads. 
Okay. <clears throat> so, general rule here is I need to rework my electrical now. So we, we've gotten the water. Okay, so the water situation is mostly resolved. Uh, now i got to figure out the electrical system. So I think we're doing pretty good. Um, we've got a bunch of water in here, so even if this ran out, actually that would be good because this, this pump would stop running and it would ease the pressure on the, on the system. And, uh, and then I could just bring more water in when I, when I need to and all of that other stuff. So actually what I might do is cancel digging out to about there. And then what that what'll happen is uh that's better. Okay. What'll happen is uh that'll stop. I'll let this water be the water supply, pump it into there. That'll ease the pressure on the electrical system. Uh in the meantime it'll give me a chance to to rejigger the electrical get it all sorted out so that the, this isn't a giant cluster F. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, how's our air? Yeah, see, because because this is not running all the time, uh, we're getting air issues. So it's all tied together. All right, I think, I think this is a good place to stop. Uh, it, it, on this note, you know, we're... We're not doing too bad. I mean, it, things are, we're lurching, we've got power issues, but this is, none of this is stuff that we can't resolve. So, yay. <laughs> I think this is actually pretty good. Uh, and I think once we can get, uh, repair all this overload stuff and get the electrical, get a bigger battery bank. What the hell's going on? Oh, okay, get a bigger battery bank. Uh, I think uh, we'll be in much better, but much better condition. So, all right, I'm going to end it here. Uh, thank you very much, everyone. For oh, let's take a look. See, this is yeah, this is what I wanted right here. Thank you very much, everyone, for being here while uh, while I lurch from the the one emergency to the next. Uh, if you have any tips, please feel free to share. Even if I like, I may not appear to implement tips and stuff like that it doesn't mean i don't learn from them and listen and uh, I, I a lot of them I, I actually like i agree with them completely it's just you know maybe the time is not right or i just simply i just don't have the resources to implement them right so uh in the meantime thank you very much everyone for being here and i hope you all have yourselves a great day bye-bye <laughs>